Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to talk about how to generate uh, structural reporting robot structural analysis uh, professional. And uh, I have the warehouse structure here. And uh, before we start, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification button. And uh, if you like this video, please put the thumb up as well. Okay, so first I will change the display of uh, the view here. I'm going to turn off the support uh, shapes and uh, turn offset on and section shape and uh, we turn the cladding off so now uh, it looks uh, better and you can click on the printout composition or you can go to file and uh, print out composition so uh, we have a lot of uh, default template here and this is for the uh, screen captures and this is the default template and this is the simplified printout you can use this uh, to print a quick uh, report but uh, it might not be an organized report so uh, you can add the structure view and click on preview so uh, this is the report and uh, this is the structure preview and you cl can click on edit and click on the structure view and uh, change the uh, preview here and return to preview but uh, i will not use this one so uh, i click on delete and I will do the screen capture and change this uh, label to 3D view and uh, click on view update upon printing and OK. And we can add this view to uh, the uh, report here. And we can uh, preview the result. So uh, this is the uh, 3D view that uh, we just add. And uh, next, you can do the screen capture for uh, the information that you want to show. For example, if you want to show the load, and I click on the line load here, and uh, we turn the panel on, and uh, you can add the uh, line load view here, and click on add and preview. So we have the 3D view and light load uh, view. So uh, you can do the same for the other load, uh, like Cephic or Win load as well. But uh, for now, if you add the default template. So uh, we add the load cases and load uh, values. But uh, I want to click on this because I want to add the peg break. So we click on these two and add. And uh, you can only preview the uh, selection here by doing the uh, right click and preview. And uh, you can view the table, but it's not uh, well organized. So uh, you can click on edit and click on the table and I will change the size of the column here and return to preview so now it's look uh, much better and close and we can preview the loads uh, values also and close now uh, next I will show the result so uh, we can go out to the results and I will show only the uh, the main frame and add new window okay 
uh, want to turn off the grid and section shape okay so we have the moment uh, force and uh, this is the uh, line load case we can uh, do the screen capture and uh, next I will add the reaction force Okay, now we can uh, do the screen capture again and uh, this is the survey okay so we can go to print our composition and add this so uh, we add the peg break and this one and next I will add the reaction for the ultimate uh, cases and global extreme and close it So uh, next, I will show the steel design information. So uh, I will select only the column and I will turn the grid on again. So I uh, will do the steel design of uh, this column. Okay, now uh, the steel verification is complete and uh, we closed it and save and i want to show the capacity uh, ratio here so we can go to results and maps on uh, members and design and click on ratio and we we'll turn on the tag and apply so we have the ratio here but uh, we we'll turn this off and uh, we can uh, change the scales also and we change this to five and one and we change the color just uh, to make it uh, uh, easy to uh, view and uh, we can do the screenshot again and next we can go to Risa storage and display so uh, you might want to click on the critical one so uh, click on the ratio and uh, select this one and we can show the calculation node and do the screen capture again and uh, let's call this member 50 okay and close and if you want to show the detail results you can click on uh, uh, calculation note 
but uh, it will be the separate uh, separate files if you want to combine this into the report only one report you can uh, click on sell and sell uh, this file and uh, next you can add the information in the printer composition so uh, first I will add uh, this view and this one but uh, I will rename this so you can uh, click on it and change so uh, column design and this one capacity uh, ratio and I will add this one also and for the uh, detailed uh, result you can click on insert from file and select the file that uh, you just saved and open and add it and uh, you can preview so the information here is not uh, well organized but uh, you can also edit this file in Microsoft uh, Word so uh, you just open it and edit in Microsoft Word and insert the file again but uh, I'm going to skip it for now and close and uh, next I will add the information of the uh, foundation design so uh, we can go to RC design and uh, select the foundation that uh, you already designed so uh, I will add uh, this view and uh, this one the reinforce uh, view and the foundation node but uh, if you click on the foundation node tab here you cannot do the screen capture so uh, in order to add this information into the calculation node you can uh, Go to results and calculation node and select the information that you want to add and OK. Now we can go to file and screen capture and OK. Now you can add uh, the information here. And uh, again, you can uh, rename this. And you can click on preview. So uh, you, if you add a lot of information, it might take uh, a while. But uh, now it's done. So uh, you can uh, view the result of the calculation node. And this is the foundation design and the calculation node of the foundation. So uh, now if you're happy with this uh, uh, result, you can save it or you can uh, print it. So uh, after it's part, we we can uh, get the PDF of the uh, calculation node and uh, if you want to edit the front page uh, so uh, you can go to print preview again and uh, click on page uh, setup and go to header and footer and edit the title page and you can uh, edit here okay so uh you got a new uh, title here and uh, you can add a lot more information here but uh, it might take a little bit longer uh, than the one that i i show you 
so uh, this is it for this video I hope you guys uh, enjoy this video and don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification button and if you like this video please put the thumb up as well so thank you so much uh, for watching I'll see you guys in my next video